everybody, Obi-Wan Kenobi here. <laughs> it is cold. I'm in my hoodie and I sleep in this thing. I mean, I've got several hoodies that I wear. Um, my favorite one is the one that's lined on the inside, but I got a fire going. It is a cloudy, cold day today. It's dreary. I don't know. It almost looks like it's going to rain. Not sure, but it's going to be getting cold by the end of this week, first to next week down um i saw one report that said it's going to get down to nine degrees so i don't know i'm just praying that that is not the case so i don't know i think it's going to be an indoor day today i'll show you some chicken tv and maybe a couple other things but not a whole lot going on I'll try and keep this a really short video um still not feeling up to par I don't know what it is. I get acid reflux, and I think that's what it is. I wake up in the middle of the night, and it's bothering me, so I need to get some medicine for that. Anyhow, not having coffee, having peppermint tea again, and um, I want to cook something just because I like to cook, but I don't have any appetite to eat it. So, well, in a little bit here, I got to go let the chickens out, and I get to see how many eggs I got. Right now, I have two dozen eggs that are just... In, in cartons <laughs> I, I'm keeping one whole full carton because I found out like I said in another video when you boil very fresh eggs um, right out of the chicken's butt they are um, they're hard to peel they come off in pieces so I read that it's because the albumin is not breaking down or something or whatever and it holds the shell to the egg white or whatever so it said to to hold your fresh Freshly laid eggs out for a week to 10 days before you boil them. So I'm going to do one dozen with that. The other dozen, I don't know. I may end up giving them away. Um, I've been cooking a lot of eggs too. So uh, these chickens are doing great. I mean, who figured that I would be so successful raising these chickens? I mean, with everything, all the horror stories everybody has given me about, you know, I'm not doing it right and... Um, I'm doing it wrong, and your chickens are going to get ate by raccoons. Well, not a single one of them has been attacked by a predator other than my, you know, um, my next door neighbor. Not the next door, the ones over. Their dogs tried to get to them once, but um, the chickens got away. But I'm doing pretty good. I mean, I'm surprised for a first-time chicken owner, you know, who had never been exposed to this kind of stuff before in the past, and Mr. Lucas chickens are doing great. They're giving him eggs daily. So, yeah, I think I'm doing okay. I'm by far not an expert yet, but I sure am learning. I, I'm very proud of myself. So, anyhow, um, well, let's go let the chickens out and see what else this day inspires. <sighs> this is just so nice. Now, I won't keep this door open all the time. Just a little bit at the beginning. And then I'll close it because it really needs a lot of oxygen at first. To get going and I kind of built built it a little bit differently this time I didn't pack it full and it seems to light better if I don't pack it like side to side top to bottom so yeah it's just burning I used a cotton ball fire starter inside an egg carton thingy and it got this going really pretty fast it is just so so nice now let's see what these crazy chickens are up to. All right, beautiful chickens, come out and greet your day. I made them some chicken and rice. Well, actually, it's just the leftover chicken and rice that I had. And actually, I ended up scrambling an egg in it. <laughs> Trying to make some chicken fried rice, but it turned out kind of mushy. I didn't do it right. Let's see if they like it any better. I thought it was terrible. The plain chicken and rice was good. I think it's a hit for the chickens. Let's see if there's any eggs. Yep. I just need one more brown egg. Don't know if I'll get one, but all three of the leg horns laid today, so that makes me happy.
just going to relax out here with my dog for the rest of the day. Maybe do a few menial chores, move some wood around and whatnot. It's cold, but it's relaxing. That's all I got for you guys today. <laughs> There's Romeo. See you in the next video. Thanks for watching everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit the bell, and y'all have a good one.